it's really our responsibility to show up in partnership and redistribute and redirect the resources that we have available for philanthropy, which honestly, otherwise maybe shouldn't be ours and should actually be in the control of communities. Well, I like to think about the grant making as a return of resources um, as to why do some people have a, a lot of wealth or wealth just period and then other folks don't. So let's think about kind of how we got there. You know, as I run a foundation and as I think about the accountability debate out there, I think it's good for us to press higher and to ask ourselves, are we really earning the public trust? Are we playing our role in society? And are we really delivering on the kind of results and solving community problems and really having the impact that our sector should be having? It is in essence for us being open to not just you know what we think, but really hearing from people that we serve and trying to serve them well and in ways that are just and righteous and true to what it is uh, is needed in their communities. Well, I'm incredibly lucky that I get to steward this huge pot of money um, and to try to make change in the world. Uh, and I feel like just a deep responsibility to do it as well as we possibly can. I think at the heart of it all is just remembering constantly that this is a public trust and it's not our money. And I, in weaving that into all you do, starting with the donor, starting the minute that that money goes into a 501c3 and is matched by the public, that it is no longer our money. We are stewards of a set of values of a family, we are stewards of a public trust, and it is our responsibility to make sure that we are constantly asking what are the needs and what can we do about them that we can do uniquely, what assets do we have, both financial and non-financial, to try to address issues that we feel are, are compelling and important. In our case, that trust and accountability, we're really experimenting with what does it mean to redistribute and reconfigure power, both in terms of how we're governed internally as a foundation and also um, kind of who's making decisions around resources, uh, how grantees sort of self-define what information they want to provide to us. We're only going to rise and fall together. And that's, you know, as I think about effective philanthropy, it really is, you know, taking less of a look at like what I, you know, want or what makes me feel good, but rather let's look at the collective whole and fun there.